So I think most people were able to get here without too much difficulty. And so we are set to begin. Agreed, Holly. Nick Letty immediately hit by Dan Girardi. Letty dump as the crowd goes into their taste great, less filling routine. Ranger and Islander fans exchanging plaudits. As Boychuk plays it in the Islander zone, ahead now to Lee. Let's go and drive. Lundquist saves. Others to the Ranger line, but no further. And the puck right by the red line is dumped into the Ranger zone. Picked off by Grabner. And a save made by Lundquist. Bouncing puck slithers loose. Call how physical they got once the Flyers try to take advantage of them a little bit. A little bouncer sent in by Strong gave Lundquist some trouble. One hit by Lee, that was on Girardi, a second against Kreider. Still as smooth as silk out there. Speaking of the All-Star game, they combined the number of hits for both teams. Nash lines up a shot, kick save! Good one made by Halak. Downers seem to have just a little bit more jump, but it's maybe home ice adrenaline. Yeah, and all I'm seeing right now are scattered, empty seats. I mean, every seat is not nearly filled. But a chance for Hickey and a save by Lundquist. Marty St. Louis looks for some space. Finds Girardi, but he didn't hold it. And the Islanders come to center. Grabowski in over the line. Now Lenny steps up, shoots Lundquist to save. He'll hold. And now Boyle behind the Ranger goal. Shots are six to five Islanders early on. Dahan up the middle. A little chip feed from Sezikis to Clutterbuck. Now to Morton. It handcuffed Lundquist, but he stopped it. Slow to get up, and he's hobbling as he makes his way to the Islander bench. Meantime, Tavares pulls up, centers Grabowski! He shot it wide, maybe Lundquist got a piece. Islanders keep it. Hickey wrists one, save made, rebound, Tavares over the net! And this one ends, but we're scoreless. 7.49 to go in the first period. Line, he gave it away, Martin a shot, Lundquist looking, but he's got it. But he's back in shape now. Gets a feed from St. Louis. Shoots. Lock the save. Step on gets it. Centers. And a save made by Halak on Stoll, who is loose. On takes a hit from Bressard. And Hamannick, one from Zuccarello. But up comes Nielsen. Nice feed to DeHaan. Let's go and drive. And a save by Lundquist. Wins it back to McDonough. Ryan McDonough on pass ahead. Batted away. McDonough lost the handle. Here's Nelson with Grabner. Nelson shooting. Save made. Grabner the rebound. Swings it to the net. Blocked the side by Lundqvist. First score. Four goals in an All-Star game. Happened right here in 1983. Stay tuned to our Ford intermission report. I'm going to have more on that, guys. A lead for Nielsen, but he lost the handle as he dribbled one to the net that was stopped by Lundqvist. With rare exception. Bailey's drive turned away. Now, when you have the best performance in the All-Star game, though, you expect to get a little rewarded. That's a typical John Tavares handled ex extremely well. But he wasn't there to win the MVP. He was there to have fun. Tavares across. Boy, Chuck. Now, Bailey to Grabowski. They score! Oh, what a tic-tac-toe series of plays. Islanders lead it one to nothing. It just doesn't get a whole lot better than that, Holly. You talk about having patience and quick puck movement. And guys stopping. Nobody was behind the goal line. They all stopped, got themselves into position, and Grabowski pays early dividends again for the honors. Tavares back over to Boychuk to Lady, and look at Grabowski sitting all along one. All wide open. There's the first pass. Boychuk back over to Bailey. Look at Grabowski. Nobody's got Grabowski. And Nielsen. Nelson again. Rangers box up. Boychuk hustled over to the near side. Now darting the other way. Gets there to accept the pass. Fire! Save Lundquist. Up the right side comes Sezikis for the Islanders. He loses his balance but holds on to the puck. Twirls it in behind for Martin. Out of the slot. Sezikis a shot. Save! Rebound! Score! Matt Martin! The fourth line comes through again. And the Islanders lead it two to nothing. And they do it with old-fashioned checking and a little chip in and go get the puck. Casey Sezikis is able to get the puck just over the blue line, come down with speed, and then the Outers go to work on a little bit of cycling. Good position, get yourself in front of the net, but it's Matt Martin who's going to finish it off with his seventh goal of the season. Both Sezikis and Clutterbuck are in front of the net. 
But it started with a good play, a chip along the boards, but Casey Sezikis getting it down low, and then both forwards. Louise, Stefan, Brassard, and Nash, the Ranger power play. Rangers 0 for 4 in two games against the Islanders this year. And remember, Franz Nielsen has a shorthanded goal. Chance for Nash, save made by Halak. They've only been 1 for 17 in their last six games, Howie, but that was a great opportunity. Franz Nielsen and Ryan Strom got caught out of position. Brassard to drive up high. It got Halak, but he's got the puck. Now to Stefan and then Boyle again. St. Louis to Nash, 15 to the power play, Boyle, what about a shot, doesn't shoot, now Stepan does, Halak's got it! And Martin chips one along, added back to center, DeHaan, now for Hamannick. Now let's check here and used to say, no harm, no foul. Long time, great voice of the L.A. Lakers. Brassard to Nash, a save, Halak, he didn't quite control the rebound, which is pitched to the corner. Brassard behind the net, now to Nash, Rick Nash, a shot, save, made, rebound, Stahl, Halak got an arm on that. Stahl again, the slot, Nash turns and shoots, that's blocked. Islanders put up a wall in front of Halak there. Averis covering for him, back at the blue line, and now the Islanders start to change. Make a quick turn ahead to Strom, now to Tavares, shoots wide, rebound, Strom, and it's off the crossbar according to the referee. Again, force the Rangers to play down low. 8.02 remaining here in the second period. By McDonough up the boards, but he took a hit, last the puck across to Miller, quick shot, save, Halak. Picks in eight weeks with some sort of an upper body injury. Yeah, and he really had picked up his game, I mean, he was hot. The Islanders will certainly miss him. Now McDonough launches one. It gives Halak trouble, but he covers. We watch the opportunity, offensive opportunity by Brian Strait, who has played very well with Vishnowski being out. Strait, a shot blocker, save, rebound, lead blocked by Klein. All the way to step on to the other side. Now it's Boyle to step on. Eric Stepan forced back to the boards. Now to Boyle, a drive tipped. Halak got that with his stick. Back to the near side, a little wide for Haglund, he catches up to it. Haglund, out of Klein, who might not have been expecting it. Stall a drive, Halak's got that, and there's no further play. Bofsky joined the party, but it's the Rangers emerging. And McDonough lugs it into the Islanders zone, left it at the line, hit by Boychuk. And here's a lead for Grabowski, quick shot, save Lundqvist. Be able to stay connected through their great community events and the community outreach. We've already spoke to the islands about that. They're going to come back to an exhibition game during the construction season here. So we're going to keep our connection with our hometown team. All right, do you want to do the tradition now? Do you want to do the yes, yes, yes? Yes, yes, yes. All right, go ahead, guys. Take it away. And maybe some chance downstairs of stay, stay, stay. <laughs> but it is three to nothing as Ryan Strom has chipped home the third Islander goal of the game. Yeah, and it, it, interesting enough, that's a nice flip-out play by, by DeHaan. That's a set breakout play off a face-off win by the Islanders. Strover's trying to go across, and it goes off the stick of McDonough. He's got his head up, he's trying to make the pass, but McDonough gets the stick. And the block shot. Moore plays it down the boards to Nash. Cross to McDonough, wrist shot, Halak's got that! Absorbed another little whack by Girardi. Now Klein for Broussard. Out to Zuccarello. He shoots. Halak the save. Rebound Broussard. Halak scrambling. Gets the whistle. And there's no further play. Tavares. To Lee in front. Flicked away by Lundquist. Just barely got a piece of it. Lee behind the net. The Islanders have everything going for them here. The clock. The lead and the five-on-three advantage. Tavares shoots, he scores! Power play goal, four to nothing Islanders. And they'll still have a power play. Tavares has got that sharp eye. You can always tell if you're starting to cheat as a goaltender a little bit. The Islanders patiently move the puck around. Again, it starts with a face-off win. And Tavares has been really good tonight. All over the ice on his face-offs, on his tenacity, his puck retrieval. 
I mean, he has just been a shark out there. The Islanders take your time on the power play once they get control, but Tavares is going to look, 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 and he just sees something there. And he's a gifted goal scorer. To Hunwick. Hunwick put it out in front, broken up. And Ryan Strom will skate it out. He's got Nielsen with him. Strom keeps going. Now he pulls up, hits the trailer to Hahn, and he shoots one off the arm of Lundquist. Put themselves in position. Dominic Moore trying to squeeze one through the check of straight. Can't do it. Recovered by Fasting. Front Hamlet. He scores. He just did push it past a lock on the short side to break the shutout. And with 8.1 seconds remaining, the Rangers on the board. The Islander lead is 4-1, and you could see how disappointed Halak is that he will not close out his second consecutive shutout against the Rangers. And Halak gets an opportunity. Dominic Moore doesn't get much of a shot. It drops down on, on Brian Street. And it's just not a whole lot left as Halak gets a part of it on the original save and tries to go across into it. But the end of it, meaning the game, has come. And the Islanders could celebrate a 4-1 win over the New York Rangers. Islanders 3-0 against the Rangers this year.